Where's the tower? I see it. Wasn't there a bed site somewhere? Uh, if there's an inn anywhere, a place I can sleep. It's a well, but I don't think I want to sleep in a well. Never mind. I'll just start the video here, yeah? Hello, everybody. Welcome to another episode of The Legend of Zelda Tears of the Kingdom. Last time, well, we got to meet uh, Pura, and we also saw Zelda turn into a fairy. And we also found out there's a giant pit down the crater underneath. Well, is it, is it a pit crater? What? What is it? I don't know. I was trying to find some beds, but I couldn't find them. Um, actually, yeah. Before we go and look outside, I want to look more into this. Dive. Oh, I can I actually do that. Hold on. I'm gonna try that again. So that you dive pressing R. Hold on. Oops. <laughs> Sorry. Okay. Hmm? Oh, it's you, Link. Pardon me for being lost in my work here. This map tends to get in, get all my attention. Oh. I'm interested in different peoples of Hyrule and where they live. It's my entire field of study. When I'm out on a deployment with the monster control crew, I spend hours poring over our maps. As such, I'm the most knowledgeable and lookout standing about Hyrule's various peoples in towns and villages. Yeah, what various Ooh. peoples? Aside from us Hylians, there are four other peoples here in Hyrule. The Rito, the Goron, the Zora, and the Gerudo. Each live in a different area and have their own unique traits, whether it's soaring in the sky or feasting on rocks. Oh. We Hylians also live in villages that reflect our unique cultures. The Sheikah are renowned for their wisdom. In fact, our most prolific researchers are among them. The leader of the lookout landing, Pura, is from the Sheikah tribe. Jab. Hmm. Hyrule has eight major places that its various peoples call home. Lookout Landing is located here in central Hyrule. Up at the northwest, there's Rito vi Village in Hebra. And then there's Gerudo Tau, that's Town, that's located to the southwest of Gerudo region. You'll find Goron City to the northeast in Elden. Travel a bit further east and you'll come across a fat cot. Sorry. Travel a bit further east and you'll come across. Sorry. Come across Tarry Town in Akala. Not too far from there is Zora's Domain. That's within Lanaru region. Oh. Continuing into southeast Hyrule, you'll come across a cluster of Hylian villages. These are within the area called Akluda. Within that cluster, you'll find Kakariko Village, where the Sheikah live. I hear the village leader is quite lovely. If you're seeking a tranquil spot, Hateno Village is worth a visit. I also hear it's become Hyrule's centre of fashion. Finally, there's Lurain Village. It's a wonderful getaway de destination. Many of the aforementioned towns and villages have been deeply affected by the upheaval. If removing even a fraction of the monsters helps soothe the peoples of Hyrule, then that's what we'll do. Our monster control crew is on patrol each day, gathering information from everyone, everywhere. And, uh, you? Hmm. I work with the monster control crew. We're tasked with protecting everyone from monsters. There's been an uptick in their population since the upheaval. But I'm not ready for... But I'm not really most skilled in combat. So instead, I use my knowledge of the areas to help determine where we should make deployments. Oh, Aww. by then. There's been an increase in the number of unfamiliar monsters since the upheaval as well. Be careful out there. Uh, okay, but... It's just, by the way. Look at all this dust. Ooh. Hey, I know that face. And any face I know is the face of a friend. Please, Link, help yourself to anything in this shelter. It's all yours to use as you see fit. Mm. But don't you dare go making a mess of this place and kicking up dust. I spent so much time cleaning, cleaning in here and there's still endless amounts of dust. Mm. Where, does, where does all this dust, dust even come from anyway? 
Um, do you really want to know? It's dead skin, dead bits of hair, and other little nasties that come off us. And inside those are various insects. Uh, bacteria, parasites, and oh, oh, look! Healthy cooking, hmm? Oh. Hey, are you new here? You may scoff, but I know a fresh face when I see one. When I say that, I can say it because I'm a newcomer too. My name is Bermano, and they put me in charge of cooking for some reason. I want to say something fancy like, For today's menu, we'll have fruit and mushroom bakes. That'll rev you right up. Oh. Yeah, I was really looking forward to saying that, but... I'm a plum. I'm plum out of apples. If I don't have any... If I don't have my most important ingredient, say goodbye to rich, full flavour. Mm -hmm. Hmm. Wait, my nose is detecting an aroma. A sweet, tangy present aroma? Could it be? Do you have an apple? Take this. <gasps> wow, you're really generous. I'm giving you the first crack at some grub. Hold on a sec. <laughs> I'm calling it Barmano Special Fruit and Mushroom Mix. Looks tasty, doesn't it? Fruit uh, and Mushroom Mix. I like to make a big deal of it, but anyone can make it. All you need is an apple, a mushroom, and a pot. You should try making some. What are you done? Anything else? <laughs> uh, actually, yeah, that makes me wonder. Have I got any weapons that... So, just trying to figure out what... Yeah. Okay, seems alright. Uh, what about the beds? Oh, hold on. Ah! Uh, yeah, let's sleep until morning. I tried to figure out that's from. Oh, that's the. Uh, oh, that was um, the shrine. Was it the shrine or something from Peck One um, Coliseum or Peck One XD or something? Anyway, uh, yeah, let's stop. Uh, actually, hold on. Oh, yeah, I saw these. <coughs> I'm trying to do the same thing like you're doing! Fine, what's the deal? Oh. Hi, sorry, but I'm busy at the moment. So I'll have to talk to you between swings. You never know when monsters will pop up, so I take my training very seriously. Oh. You might have noticed, but each sword handles differently, so it's wise to try different types to get used to the feel. If you know their handling and practice pl plenty, the fact that they, they're decayed won't matter so much. So that might... Alright. I think the decayed weapons make sense for the mechanics of the game with the fusion weapons. Like, what's the point of fusing weapons if, um, you know, you can have you can find claymores and that? Nope, they made it in law reason. Like, where's copper anyway? Oh, he's here. Here, have an apple. Good boy. Alright, so... Hmm... Actually, one thing I want to check... Oh! Well! Alright. Let go! Ow. No, right, let me go here. Ooh! There's a smashable there. Uh, I think this is the only, um, is it portal? No, hold on. No, 
No, I can't smash that, unfortunately. That sucks. We have to come back to that another time. Wow. Can you get... I don't know. Anyway, I need to get up here before I... Yep. I'm just going to run out of stamina. No, you don't. Okay. Okay, so I want to try and see if I can get that armor. Where is it? It was, uh... Here we are. Alright. Wait, hold on. What are you ah. saying? Sorry, do so. Hold on. Oh. Alright, hold on. Someday I'll be able to go back to my hometown. Until then, I'll. Oh, wait, what about your hometown? Ah. I come from a small fishing town called Luane Village. It's way to the south on the southeastern corner of Highwall. Used to be a peaceful place, too. Mm. But then pirates arrived. Pirates? I used to run the village, uh, village's general store, but when those pirates arrived, I had to grab all the goods I can and carry and run. I don't know what, how it's going there now. I hope I can return someday, but for now, I'll just keep selling as much stuff as I can. Please, let me know if there's anything you like. Bye, my stuff! Uh, what can I sort them out by? By type, power. Oh. Not by price. Because I know... That's a shame. Uh. Not interested? That's fine. It's been a pleasure doing business with you. Bye. Oh. Oh, that's uh. 70. Yeah, I'll take that. Oh. So generous of you, sir. You made me very happy today. Oh, that's what I was waiting before. I like these better. What should I know? I better wear these. Hmm, getting there. How is... Hold on. Yeah, no, it's better armor-wise. And we got cold resistance as well. Probably not the best idea to have in summer, but... hey oh, what, do you, what are you going to do? Uh, here we are. But there's something I need to really think about. It's costly to get stronger. Hello. Hmm. If I put this here, then this goes there. Oh, no, no. That's not quite it. Uh -huh. That should do it. Mm -hmm. Oh, hey, Link. You're set? I just wrapped up here myself. The travel point is working fine now. Or it will be once you do your part. What part's that? Hey. We're ready, Joseph! Pull the switch! Hey! Skyview towers have now been activated. They were activated. Yeah. Okay, Link, your turn. Ah. Go on. Hold a pure pad over that terminal. All right. Huh. 
All right, the Skyview Tower is now is now active on your map. That means you can now use this travel point to get here at any time instantly. The same is true for every Skyview Tower you add to your pure pad. Impressive, right? Mm -hmm. uh, Skyview Towers are just about more than just tra are, mo are about more than just traveling quickly. Their primary function is to survey the area, or simply put, to make a map. The pure pad works with the Skyview Tower and scans the topography directly onto the map. Uh -huh. Pretty great, huh? Only thing is, you need a power glider when you're scanning. It takes a lot of skill and nobody here had what it takes. To be honest, that's why we haven't tested it out yet. We need to do. Which brings us to this. <gasps> we got a power glider! What was it? This item given to you by Pura lets you ride the wind and glide through the sky. Press X in midair to activate it. Ooh. Right, it's showtime. Let's start with the test scan. Now it's time for our very first test launch. I mean, uh, our first test. Just step over there into the circle, and you find and find me afterward. All right? Huh. I'll be observing from the research lab. Yeah. When the first when the test scan is over, we'll have the final briefing on the search for Princess Zelda, and I'll also need to update your map with the places here on here. Wet. Sorry. <clears throat> And I also need to update your map with the places where the upheaval has wrecked the most havoc. Best of luck! Sorry about that. Uh, so I examine it and, uh, oh, uh, hello, uh, can I help you? Uh, 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 um, what? Uh, what is going on? Uh-oh. Whee! Alright, so wait. I don't know if we have to press button, but I'm going to press X. <laughs> it's the intro sequence all over again! Oh, I don't even do. Scanning. Scanning. Sorry, I'll shut up. Surface map has been updated. Sky map updated. Wait, what happened to the cable? Does it... Wait, hold on, hold on. Where's the cable? What happened to the cable? Uh, okay. I don't know, I'm gonna go with style. And oh, I thought it'd be a little bit more. Oh, oh, oh you saw that? Yeah. Oh, that's cool though. So I have to go back up here then. Oh, it wasn't a bungee jump, but from the ground. Uh -huh. And up. Welcome back! There was some good gliding up there. I expected nothing less. So, how did it go? Did you get a proper map scan? Uh -huh. Good, that map is crucial to our search. There are Skyview Towers in every region of the world. You want to make a point of revisiting them yes. all. Right, let's talk about the upheaval. It's affected more than just our ca their castle. Reports of other strange phenomena have been coming from all over Hyrule. Let's take a look at our map. The first report comes from Hebra to the northwest. Next is Elden to the northeast. The Gerudo are reporting trouble in the southwest. And finally, there's Lanayu to the east. These strange phenomena are connected. Oh, are concentrated in these four regions. Hmm. I can't say for certain, but I've got a nagging suspicion that we might find out more about Princess, Princess Zelda by looking into these phenomena. Uh -huh. Hey, Doc, I don't know if this is helpful, but I heard something weird the other day. It's about someone who might have seen Princess Zelda at Rito Village over Hebra recently. Hmm. Huh? 
it is pretty weird. Yeah. Generally speaking, I don't put much stock on heresy. Oh, in heresy. But this does sound like it's worth looking into. Oh, and before I forget, Link, we've asked the Lucky Clover Gazette to help us in the search for Princess Zelda. There's nobody who knows more about the ongoings on in Hyrule than them. You can find them near the entrance to the Vito Village. If you go there, you should speak with the, so, with the editor. I'm sure she could help out in some way too. Mm -hmm. I'll be here, directing a variety of invest investigations into the upheaval's many cavern cavern chasms. What I call chasms, caverns, and new ruins. I will also be looking into different villages. Someone somewhere might know what's happened to the princess. Yeah. I'm counting on you to check out the major phenomena that have been troubling regions around Hyrule Link. You'll find Princess Zelda one way or another. Oh, hold on. So sorry, Josie, you got something to... Oh. Sorry, I can't talk now. There's something I've got to discuss with Goggles right away at our research into the chasms. Let's talk later. Oh. Okay. Now, as tempting as it is to go across the regions, I think we need to... Let's say, get a bit of experience first. You know, get our get some resources, get set up. You know, the, you know the gist. Okay, so club sledge. Oh, zonite powered. So oh no, if you look, zonite powered. Hmm. <laughs> All right, copper. Let's go. Yeah, your steering is very wide. I've got to be careful of that. There you go. Hmm. There's something over there. Oops. Okay, let's just get that choo-choo jelly. Alright, so I'm not sure where to go exactly. So, what I thought to do. Um, okay, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. on. Alright, let's get. Because well, what I know about this game is that um, your know, horse does follow paths automatically. So, while I'm riding here, uh, mindlessly, uh, which of the four places should we go to first? Now, of course. Um, I will be making videos after this. I'm trying to get eight videos out on my first uh, week. Or, you know, for my first time playthrough, I want to get those done. Ooh. <laughs> Alright, let's see. Who first? Alright, Zonite Club. <laughs> Like spiky shield, that. Oh, if I save the. Oh, I'm going very curious. What happens if I. <laughs> Boko Bow, I don't really care. Let's see, Hellbard. Okay. Yeah, taking these on does give you a little bit of uh, resource power. Or, you know, get you some resources. Sorry, I sort of got mixed up with the. Uh, Power thing there. Arrow, arrow. That's a rock hammer. Uh, what's that? Ooh. The coblin horn. Nice, not bad. So, there is something over there I've noticed. But yes, as I said before, uh, 
Wait, hold on. So there's a blue. There's a blue path. Up. Oh, it's the vision border. Oh, here's a good one. And one more. Have it in her. Oh no! Hold on. Sorry! Sorry, Copper! That was my bad. I miscalculated that dreadfully. Sunderland! Wow, we done. Alright, I done. I done. Here, yeah, have some apples. I think this does heal your horse as well. Yeah, apples and carrots, that's uh, what they generally eat. I don't know if they eat I don't know if they eat anything else, but Rusty Shield. Stick. It's burning. Yeah, so if it so yeah, I'm not gonna do any of the I'm not gonna go to any of those regions just yet. That's how you do it. Oops. <laughs> All right, hold on. All right, let's grab those. You can tell because you can see the sparklies down the thing. Okay, so what to do first, huh? All right, so hmm, there is a tower there. Hmm, how far is that? Oh, actually, that's not far at all. Hold on. Okay, I'm trying to see if there's any other towers. Something there, but I don't think there's a tower. <laughs> Hold on. So, you just gotta look what's directly ahead of us then. Oh, that's what those are. All right, so. Oh, hold on. Right, trot here. Oh, I love the power collider. Can you customize it, I wonder? Oh, hold on. Oh, yeah. Uh, anyone recognize... Where is it? There you go. <laughs> that makes it way easier. What happens if you get shot that down? Does that give you... Yeah, it gives you some meat. A raw bird thigh. Yeah, I'm such a savage, aren't I? <laughs> but that was a good demonstration of how the... Uh, that, wow, I, that was really cool. I mean... I'm just as new to this as most other people are. Okay. That's... Ah, I thought I was going to land in here then. Alright, let's go to this one up ahead. Uh... Hold on. Whoa! Sorry. Want to get some goodies. Hold on, what's that? Oh, I thought it was one of those. Good boy. Oh, that's where we were earlier. I don't think... Have we Copland's? No, they haven't respawned. So, that's what the Blood Moon is basically for. It's just a way for... Well, it's a good in-law reason for respawning, basically. Oh, hold on. Oh, I haven't got a... After the piggy! Oh, actually, I'm going to try and run the piggy over. Run the piggy over! 
That's it. And then we better go to a forest and get you some... Ooh, hold on. Okay. Oh, of course. Yeah, no, definitely not a good idea. Actually, let's have a look. If I shot these guys down, what happens? Okay, that's not a good sign. Whoa! Oh, that's not good. <laughs> Yeah, that's why, um, yeah, maybe be careful with rocks. <laughs> I thought for a second I was being very smart. I thought I was being smart. But nope, I'm a dummy dum dum dum. Okay, don't do that again. Alright, let's just head straight over there. Uh, just be, yeah, I think that's a, oh, hold on. I saw... I don't know. Oh, if you're wondering what those spurs are... Oh. Hold on. Like, nothing chasing us. I don't think there is. If there was anything, then they'll face my zone eye blade. Hello. There you go. Thank you. I need an axe. Oh yeah, that's how uh, that works. Okay. Yeah, be careful around trees now. Any more? Any more of you suckers I'm gonna take care of me? No? Mm -hmm. No. Okay, um, I need some sharp stones now. Love angled up. Um, there we go. Hold on, there is something over there. Let's see if I find market there. Then Ah, there's something there. Making use of that feet of the markers, huh? Uh, all right. I need. Have I, have I got a stick? Okay. Um. I just need a sharp boulder. Where are you? Oh. Coming, copper. Hey, I saw that. That was slick. Very slick, boy. <laughs> Acts like I'm hip, but really I'm not. Oh, that was the rest of this quick hit. Uh, are there any many of you around? Oh, yeah, there are quite a few of you. Uh, no, that's not a sharp stone. Oh, uh, are they? I see. Alright, slowly go around here. Alright. 
So we have got some. So if you saw in the distance, we saw a moblin, not far from. Wait, wait what the heck is this? Also, oh, barrel. Let's just see if there's anything here. You never know. There might be some goodies. Might be a secret chest or something or other. We don't know. But by looks of it, we. Oh, hold on. Ah, just some general resources. Okay. Oh, uh, no. Oh, hold on. Uh, would that work? <laughs> What's up? <laughs> I don't know if that works like a axe, but we'll try it. Okay, so I only got one more beacon left to place. No, I I know I'm trying to get that. Oh, there we go. Okay, so that one we're gonna infiltrate. Yep, this one right here. I don't know how you get back to the sky. That's what I'm, that's what I'm curious about. Hold on. I want to get these fireflies. Sunset firefly. This fly fire. This firefly glows gently in the dark when cooked with. The okay, it's. Basically a sneaking effect. You gotta be sneaky to grab the sneaky. Right, go there. Jump, jump, and grab. Now, of course, I could hack this and just go around, but I think it's better if we got some resources. You know, we got a rusted shield on a stick. Oh no, that's a cop that's a blue bacoblin. Those things deal a fair bit of damage at the moment. Okay. Jump. Just get my weapons out. Now of course. Whoa! Ow. Whoa, hello. Whoa, what was shooting at me just then? A blue coblin horn. A two pronged horn with sharp edges and tips. Touch the weapon to moderately increase its attack power or brew it into an Alexa. High durability. Hmm. Oh wow! Oh, those are like bonuses, aren't they? Okay, so we got that. There was something. Was it? A... Oh no, blue moblin! Ow! Oh, that didn't take a ton of damage. Uh, let's see. <laughs> There you go. A blue moblin horn and a moblin fang. Is that it? Hmm, must be. I mean, it was not really carrying anything in particular. Uh oh. Oh, hold on. Oh, hello. Hello. Whoa. Oh, sneaky. All right, I better grab something to eat before I take more of these guys on. Oh, no, that's definitely not. Jump attack. Okay. Then... Wait, what did I put? Never mind, I was trying to get up a coblin horn. No, no barking doggies! Is 
Sleep tight, my baby. But still, love, don't cry as I blow you both up. Spiked Boko Shield. Okay, um... Alright, have I... Oh. No, I want to... Uh... Yep. Oh, there's a blue big guy there. Hold on, there is a sneaky thing you can do. Oh, 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 he is wearing, oh, he's wearing armor. Oh, hello. Ow. <laughs> what was that? Okay, I'm not doing that again. Oh my gosh, I need to get stronger. I need more hearts and I bet need better armor. And I need stuff to sell. Wait, did I just lose all my stuff then? Oh. Did I lose all my stuff then? Did I lose the uh Did I believe the coblin horns? Yeah. I've... So you do I think it's all like a checkpoint really. It takes you to the nearest checkpoint. Okay, um Yeah. Okay, we can't do that yet. Let's instead focus on these Zonai ruins. Hmm, hold on. Whoa, I thought I... Okay, not sure what's going on here. What are those? What happens if I do this then? Like, that's glowing yellow, so I don't know if that means anything at all. Eh, better nothing. Oh. Oh, wait, I, can I just. No? Hmm. They do stick in the ground. So if I very vaguely like Interesting. Uh, it doesn't help me out though, considering I need to actually. Unless.
Hold on, so if I did this... Is it just the ground or was it any material? A large whoa Zenite charge massive energy stored within. Put it on a Zenite device dispenser or use it temporarily to prevent a Zonite energy cell from losing power. Uh, again, that makes me wonder how do you actually Anyway, let's do this trial. Skip that. Uh, fixed device. Uh, oh. Oh, yeah, I saw these earlier. Uh, probably is, though. Okay, it doesn't. It doesn't stick into, uh, regular Zonite stuff. Hold on. Wait, that's taking the back of it. Okay. Okay, uh, let's try this instead. Alright, and then... Oh, hello! <laughs> I did try to jump! Oh, at least a... Do I correct it? Or would it... Jump on! Up! Just please don't. <laughs> All right, hold on. Is it like shiny both ends or just, I don't know. All right, no jinging. Okay, I do that and Okay, so... <laughs> Alright, so if I were to... Okay, so if I strike this, is that all? Oh, uh, what happened there? Alright, so this is like pinball, basically. Well, wait, hold on. What did I just do? I don't know what I did there, but I did it. So, uh, this one's a more interesting one. Okay. 
So how do we get it? So got one switch. That's odd. So we got infinite balls form falling from there. Uh, how do I? That's weird. I know it's the obvious way, but I want to try and get that sweet secret as well. So... Hmm, if I want this to work, what do I need to do? Wait, hold on. It's not like attached to the chains here. Well, let's attach it then. No? Can I cut through these? No? No, it's not like that sign of material. I kind of am interested. <laughs> oh nice, a pickaxe! Sorry, I just wanted to try that. Oh yeah, definitely don't throw it. But I'm still curious though, so... Okay... I want to be high in that. Like that, I suppose. Then... No. Is it? Would that put be possible? No, I don't know. How do you get that? All right, let's see how. so confusing. That did not feel legal. Hmm. But hey. That's a good question actually. Why don't I just do this? Yep. Nope. But I'm on to something there. 
I think I'm onto something. then all right so oh no I was on the right track though No, hold on. Mm. Right, this will take a bit of thinking. This right. And if I do that. Oh, that's not very far at all. Oh, that makes no sense though. Less. The ball goes. Hmm. Wait, hold on. This gets in the way, right? So what if What if I attach that there? On and there we go. Uh, yeah, this is not going to work, but oh, I lost a <laughs> don't know how that happened. So, uh, what's the deal here? Oh, dang, I can't even reach the top of it now. Oh, I don't get this. This is tough. Why can't I just move you to the other side? Oh, blind. So, uh... Okay, that's attached.
I have no idea how this is going to go. Whoa. Uh, what happened there? That makes no sense. Uh, oh my gosh. Maybe the key to this is to... Wait, if you want to rest All right, let's restart. So I think what you gotta do is throw these away. Throw those away and... Everything should be small. All except that bit of plank. Do I need a plank? Hmm. This is going to take me a while. Oh, that's what I used before. Maybe instead of trying to rely on that plank thing, maybe... Problem is, it's inverted. What? No. Yeah, future me, um, just cut to the point where I actually figure it out. You know what? I give up on this. If anyone knows, <laughs> what the heck is up with this puzzle? I don't like it. That's a ta Oh my gosh. I don't know how it works. I give up. I give up. Please let me know. <laughs> I've been at this for like 20 minutes. No bonus weapon or anything, but blimey. At least I get to complete this. Is there something I'm missing here? Is there something I'm missing? Oh, I'm an idiot. Please let me know if I miss anything. And uh, remind me what shrine it's on, just in case I forget. Uh... That'd be sped up for you guys, but for me? No. Ugh, I'm just going to record another 10 minutes and I'll quit it for this episode. At least I got this shrine now. I think this is like a little, um, I don't know. So. Yeah, a horse heard us. I don't. Uh. So where I am right now. Uh, okay, is that? Uh, oh yeah, that's definitely not what we want. I want to go there. Much of that's already where I've been. I doubt it, but that would be very ironic. 
Oh, what do you know? Does that work? Hey! It worked! Oh, hold on. Slap your bum! Sorry, dogs are barking! I don't know why they're barking! Stop barking! Stop doing your comrades! I don't know, like, because um, I got a house myself, so I don't... Who's blowing their horn? No one. Oh, it's you. Hi. Thank you. All right, let me just grab your remains. This is very dark. <laughs> let me just grab your remains, just for a second. But yeah, I got a house myself at the moment, so I just thought to do some of this. A moblin horn. Oh, that's what I was attached to. Yeah, um, again, anyone knows what those puzzles, um... Anyone knows the solution to that puzzle? I'm just absolutely traumatized. Because that was ridiculous! How was I supposed to figure that out? Like, seriously. That was just ridiculous. No, maybe it's just something I'm too dumb to understand. Anyway, uh... For ap more apples from me ponies? No, that's blunt. You want something sharp. Is this... No. Alright. Yep. Alright, so... One thing we can do before I... Right, let's make some food. Well, I just threw one tomato in that, and that's the result. It's just ran- I think it's a little bit randomized, this. This will be a lot of hearts. Look at that. Five- eight. Eight hearts. That's good. It's really good. Come on, Kappa! So, I think that's my main goal at the moment, is to try and get stronger. Is there something there? Hold on. I think there was something in here. That's weird. Also, is that the one I've just been to? No, it's not. It's uh, over there. No, it's a fresh one.
Yep, um, I'll just do this trial and put it in this episode. It might be a lot shorter in post, I do apologise. But, <laughs> that trial is really, like, um, I know I ask this a lot, um, I, because I don't want to look up too much myself, but if anyone has any advice for playing this game, not, no spoilers, but if anyone has any advice for, you know, just any tips and that, please let me know. And don't say, just don't suck at the game. I, oh, hold on. No, no, go. Dang it. Alright, let me take this. We got arrows from that. So we got cars. Oh, we got cars. So I presume where the head is is where they face, or where they head to. Excuse the pun there, that was actually... I like though that they um, designed it, so... I don't know if that works. Hold on, I want to move that a bit more. No, I want to move that forward. What the heck is that? No, I want to move this forward. That's better. Don't know if that's... Oh, this is incredibly unbalanced. <laughs> Look at that. What is this balancing? Okay. Um. Let's try that. Let's try this, okay? It's gonna work. Meep meep. I know it's badly damaged, okay. Open these doors, I don't know how far. Oh, oh. Oh, hold on. Let's go have that constantly sport and um, spinning. Let's go. Cool. Okay, so how do I approach this then? I think just as an activation thing. Oh, I was meant to put it on the other side. Doesn't matter. Oh, nope, 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 nope. I jumped too early. Uh, um, go. Okay. Build a bit. So, uh, do I shoot it with an arrow? Oh! I can do it like that, can't I? That's nice. Can 
Come on. There we go. Alright, yes, we know, we know. I am the one with the an infected arm. I am the one with the infected arm. <laughs> this game's hard. <laughs> oh, I'm just dumb. I'm dumb. I'm just dumb. No, there's no doubt about it. I'm just dumb. It's not hard. I'm just dumb. Oh, my doggies. Yeah, I'll wrap up the video in a moment, puppy. Yeah. So, as long as there's no uh, enemies about, I think that'll do for this episode. I don't know how long this will be. I... Oh, shooting star, are you kidding me? Yeah, so, thank you so much for watching this episode, and of course, I think you know what to do. Uh, again, any hints or tips that are not spoiler, that don't spoil anything, please let me know down in the comments below. Seriously, it would mean a lot. I can even shout out your name if you want, just um, so let me know if you're okay with that, okay? So, in the past, present, or even future, I will see you there. Bye! So you're not losing my sanity right now?